Talofa, guys, your boy Uso Evil. I got a surprise for you guys today. So, I'm on my way home right now. And I finished work early. Usually, I'm out late. Bro, I've been grinding for the last freaking two weeks, sorting out this sick deal. But we got a new car today, and I'm on my way to meet the guy that towed it. It came all the way from Texas. I am very excited to show you guys. Bro, let's go and see this freaking car. So, right now, I brought, brought my boys to work right now. Bro's taking a nap. We're in the mid middle of the Utah summer heat. So yeah, man, on my way home, I'm stuck in traffic right now. It's about, I'd say like 4.30, 5 o'clock. And I'm excited, bro, like for real. Like this car, you guys, you wanna see it. I can't wait till we get home. We're almost there. So stay tuned, be patient. Um, first of all, I wanna say thank you to everybody who subscribed to the channel. Your boy looks like a mess right now, bro. But I appreciate every single one of you that's uh, been supporting me, man. So, anyways, on today's video, like I said, we just picked up a new freaking car. And I'm excited to go and see it. Bro, shout out to everybody who's been supporting your boy from the go, man. I'm so excited to be back on YouTube. Had a couple weeks off, guys. I enjoy it. But today's the day. I actually got two cars, man. I got two cars that I want to show you guys. So we're almost over around the corner. I'll see you guys when we freaking get there. Let's go another two to add to the fleet. Let's go. I'm excited, man. Yes, Utah is so beautiful. Man, all these trees. Bro, I'm so, I'm, I'm in a really great mood right now. excited to show you guys what cars we got and what plans we got in store for this car anyways it looks like the car is still on the trailer right now all right so i just got to the house right now hi babe you like the new car let's check it out guys so i want to introduce you guys to the new car man all the way from texas this is literally my my first time seeing the car as well so bear with me let's check it out man guys and there it is I want to introduce you to you guys my uh, 1994 Mitsubishi Mirage. And you know what? This car here is Evo swapped. So I'm really excited to go dive into this car and show you guys uh, exactly what we got. So this car, right off the bat, it's got an Evo engine, authentic Evo engine, Evo transmission. And then the rear end is just about done. Okay, so the car's not running right now. We got a bunch of things to do. And I got a lot to walk you guys through. It's actually a Mirage that's right-hand drop, right-hand drive swapped as well. So there's the Mirage, guys. I'm really excited to start cranking on this thing. Right now, the car's been sitting for eight years. Uh, I'm not sure if it runs right now, so we're gonna get it off. We're gonna check the fluids of the car, and then we'll go from there. So they're just putting air in the tire right now. I'll show you guys on the the rear subframes on. We still. I spoke to the guy who built the car and right now the, everything holds up but the drive line is rubbing so the rear subframe has to be adjusted. We're going to uh, do that uh, so I'm going to, there's a lot, a lot of work to go into the car otherwise we can keep it front wheel drive, change the fluids, crank up the car but stay tuned man I'm really excited for this. Abs, it's finally time I'm excited we got the Evo off of the trailer and we're ready to take a deeper look into it bro come and check this out dude what do you think of the evo good I think I really missed the old you. I never switched, I thought I told you. Remember them nice ways to go through. I put my feelings in these pro tools. 
We mob around up in them old school. We selling dope on the side to get some old look. I know that you ain't never learned about that show fool. My little baby, that's my third, that's my go to. I only price to show me love and that's so true. But I ain't tryna get caught up with all that old news. Taking turns up off the pipe, we got me so loose. You never taking after goofballs, but I'm gon' make it through this loop for. I make it more before the move for. Why ain't for me, baby? Got me hypnotized when you be moving on school with it. You play hard to get that. You make easy, make me want you even more. You can't find it in the store. Baby, I protect your heart. Promise I won't ever do you got me from the start. Baby, I'ma give you all that I got. Guys, so. Here we are, we're now standing in front of our 1995 Mitsubishi Mirage. Basically, it's the same car as the white one. Like I said, guys, this car is almost done with the all-wheel drive swap. I showed you guys the rear end when it was on the trailer. We are going to take another look into that. But right now, what this does for Uso spec is that it eliminates us having to do the 4G swap, the all-wheel drive swap. And we could basically just part out the mirages that we don't want and invest that money into the ones that we really do want to. And bro, here it is, my 1995 Mitsubishi Mirage. There it is, as you can see, that was a, the engine was taken from a, from an Evo 1. So this car was built in the early 2000s. And one of the OGs from the Mitsubishi Mirage forums still had this car and it's been sitting for eight years. One of the cool things about this car I want to show you guys, right? Look at that. It's right hand drive swapped. Hell freaking yeah. It's got Evil 4 interior. So I don't know if it runs. So right now the wife's going to go get some fuel, um, some fresh fuel. I'm going to start unloading these spare parts. Um, it smells like rear diff fluid back here and dude if you know you know that shit stinks so I gotta it's got the axles I'll show you guys right now so I think this is like some aircon unit part and then you just the rear diff there the brace but um, we have to get the car up on a jack and realign the subframe but right now the car's front wheel drive the guy said it does drive so it's just a matter of getting new oil we're gonna drop out the fuel put some new fuel in it and then put a battery on it and we'll be able to crank her up so that's what we're gonna do so without further ado let's get into this video let's start working on this damn thing update fam right now we got my son jay over here washing the evo or mirage whatever we want to call it we're not sure yet but Bro, right off the bat, the yellow's cleaning up pretty good. I like it, man. Although it doesn't look like the real yellow, dandelion yellow. So at one point, we're going to get it repainted. Bro, with a quick wash and dish, dishwashing soap, can't go wrong, man. Looks decent already. You can't even tell, bro. I'm telling you. Sheesh. I think my next mod is going to get these dark headlights. But I mean, bro, you can't even tell they're fake. You can't even tell. And then, of course, you got this beast over here. You can't even tell, bro. I'm telling you. Sheesh. Guys, what's going on, man? Just wanted to show you guys the update of the Mirage Evo 2. So, let's get into it. As you can see, we got the car up on the jack stands. The oil is draining right now it's probably done ready to plug her back up put the new oil we got the purple stuff going in and then um we fixed a couple vacuum lines to clean the motor uh we got some spark plugs we want to check in but we're gonna right now i got the fuel tank out so there's a fuel tank there's a bunch of ac parts that came with the car i know i feel so bad throwing it away man but I don't need it. And then here's all the rest of the all-wheel drive parts. There's a transfer case. Um, right now, I'm, I've got the fuel tank. All the stale fuel is now out. And it's just a matter of putting it back into the car and then put the fuel lines back on, check the fuel pump, put a new battery on there. Um, and then we should be able to start her up after we put the new oil, of course. But yeah, we're, we're uh, battling the sun right now. She's going down, as you can see. So, 
if we don't finish today we'll we'll cap the episode there or we'll just move on to tomorrow after work but yeah man thank you to everybody um who's been joining me on this adventure of saving these evos or fake evos so yeah here it is fuel tanks back in you can see they have a makeshift floor there um we're gonna cross that bridge later when we do the all-wheel drive shit but right now we're gonna button her up and try to get her turned over so yeah i'll hit you guys with the update later here's all the stuff the spare stuff that came with the car that i want to keep we got some manual pedals for another project evo one blinkers the water pipe I want to keep that AC condenser. I don't know why I want that, but it's spare for my real Evo. And then some old school mirror tinted windows and a valve cover. And here's the rear end parts. So I'm going to throw this in and then uh, I'll get back to you guys. Fam, so here it is, the car. Unfortunately, right now we haven't got, um, we haven't been able to get it started. As you can see, it's dark here. We got the new battery. Um, tomorrow we got new plugs coming, but there was a kill switch for the fuel pump that I found and the fuel pump does not sound healthy so but yeah we're gonna uh, cap it there guys thank you to everybody um, this is basically the new car so hopefully tomorrow we have it running but for today I think that's it man I appreciate everybody supporting your boy from the go man you see how it is we out here who's so evil so yeah, I'm gutted that we weren't able to get it started today, but it is what it is. It's not a big deal right now. She's cranking. She's got power. I don't think she's getting fuel. So tomorrow what I'm going to do is um, go to the injector, uh, the fuel rail on the intake side and uh, remove that. And then we'll prime it, start it and see if there's actually fuel getting to the injectors. Bro, so I'll see you guys on the next one. There it is, the beautiful edition the mitsubishi 1995 mirage make sure you guys look out for the next video we'll go into more depth with um what we got planned for the car and what we want to do so right now i'm trying to get the car started so next week you'll go into race pro tuning and uh, we're gonna try and get to this all-wheel drive conversion so i'm excited about that but at the end of the day money talks thank you all for tuning into another video man sure boy we so evil let's go